Well, John, now that you've been introduced to the ways of green infrastructure, it appears that you're starting to incorporate a little green into your life. Sure am. That's great, but you're cooped up in here. You gotta get out there, out into the world. Maybe you're right. You're darn right I'm right. Let's go! Whoa, that was weird. Sorry about that. Still working out the kinks. Oh, nice tree. I know, right? Trees are a great example of simple green infrastructure. They add color to their surroundings and clean the air. Oh, hot day. And trees offer shade from the hot sun. Oh, that's better. Sure is. Whoa, a little warning next time. Wow, look at all this green. Nice. Yep, parks are important places for people to gather and be active. Green spaces that include parks, woodlots, and valleys play a vital role in keeping our air and water clean, counteracting the damaging effects of pollution. Breathe in that sweet, sweet air. Green spaces are a refuge for wildlife and buffers against the impacts of climate change. I love wildlife and I'm great with all animals. Hey buddy! And green infrastructure doesn't stop there. Permeable pavement works like a sponge to soak water into the ground. Oh yeah? Oh. Spilled your water there, I see. No worries, because more precipitation soaks into the ground rather than running down the nearest storm drain, permeable pavement reduces flooding and lessens the need for subsurface drains, piping, and sewers. This saves the city money and gets water to the trees. Smart. Very. Now go, John, and see if you can find other green infrastructure in your city. I, I will, but, but first, can you tell me more about that teleporting thing? It, it would really save me on bus fare. Sorry, gotta go.